I was eight years old, you know, I came with my mother, come somewhere near here. We got a lot of scrap materials from the factory remnants, you know that. We make, that's how I start oh, wow. making my own clothes. Every time I come, I come back to Hong Kong, I will come here and to look for some trims. And when you come here, you feel so excited, you know, oh, wow, this, this can work, this can work, you know. And the colors, because they have all, like even the fringes, they have all different colors, you know. This is really my place for inspiration. I really mm. love this neighborhood. All the resources here, you know, the fabrics, you know, so inexpensive and then so many choices. You can do so much with it. So you think this is a really valuable resource for young designers and young local designers in Hong Kong? Oh, definitely. This is the place that this really represents Hong Kong. When I started my collection, I have to come here first you know, to really to see all the fabric, to get the inspiration, mm. to just see, you know, this is really my place. And I really set to hear and see that it's going, you know. They're building a hotel. hotel. So this is going to turn into like really mm. a hot place. So it's quite rare for a city to have this kind of arrangement, right? That you can just get swatches. Uh, I can't get it in New York, you know, like every time you, you just nothing like this There's nothing like this in New York. Nothing like this in New York. Okay. I, I don't know why, you know, people say that Hong Kong is a cultural desert, but I do not think so, you know. Hong Kong gives you so much, you know, you can just have, depends how you want to use it.